Hello, I'm Sharon Tay. We want to update you on the stories we're working on tonight. This is CBSLA.com's The Rundown. Health officials have confirmed a new measles exposure at LAX. The infected person was in the Tom Bradley Terminal on July 23rd between 2 p.m. and 6 p.m. It can take up to 21 days for measles symptoms to show up after exposure. A mountain lion was caught on camera crossing the 405 freeway in the Sepulveda Pass. The male mountain lion, known as P61, made his way east of the freeway on the morning of July 19th. Park Service officials say this is the first time during the course of the 17-year study of mountain lions in and around the Santa Monica Mountains that a GPS collared lion has crossed the 405 freeway. Well, meatless Impossible Burgers are showing up in more places. Today, Burger King rolled out its Impossible Whopper and food service company Sodexo says Impossible Burgers will be available this fall at about 1,500 cafeterias, including uh, the ones in colleges, hospitals, and corporations across the country. Well, hundreds of Beatles fans came together today. They gathered in front of the iconic Abbey Road Studios to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the group's photo shoot for the album. John, Paul, George, and Ringo strutted across the street in front of the recording studio on August 8, 1969 creating what is now one of the most well-known album covers of all time. And now here's Alex Biston with a check of her forecast. Hi, Sharon. Yeah, heading into tomorrow, temperatures, well, are going to be a little bit cooler than what we felt today. We're talking 70s along the coast inland for the valleys, 80s and then 90s for the Inland Empire and up towards the high desert as well. Lower 90s up towards Palmdale, nice and comfortable along the coast in the lower 70s. And then uh, we're going to be seeing temperatures around 92 degrees for Riverside, 91 for Lake Elsinore, and 94 up towards San Bernardino. So we are going to be keeping these cooler and below average temperatures through the weekend. And then by Monday, high pressure is going to expand back west. That will boost up our temperatures by just a few degrees. So we will see the return of triple digit heat for the high desert communities, upper 90s for the Inland Empire, and the mountains in the lower 80s. Sharon? All right, Alex, join us on CBS 2 News at 5, 6, and 11 for the latest on your weather forecast and all of our top stories. This has been CBSLA.com's The Rundown. And watch CBS and Los Angeles streaming 24-7 on CBSLA.com or on the free CBS News app. We're also on Xbox One, Roku, PlayStation, Amazon Fire, and Apple TV. For Alex Piston, I'm Sharon Tay. Have a great evening, everyone.